Hello everybody, welcome back. In this video I'm going to be uh, showing you the best ways to complete all the achievements in uh, the game. So currently there's like 47 of them. They actually added uh, 3 achievements recently. So I'm going to also tell you the best ways to get them as well. So for, for starters, you just gotta beat all the main world. I'm not gonna explain how to do that. It's really simple. Literally, just uh, over time, you should be able to get world one, two, three, four, five, six, whatever. Just beat them all. You know, it's not too hard. But then the hard part comes in when you have to do speed trials, because you know you have you get achievements for speed trialing them. So for speed trials, the the best method I can suggest is like really memorize the charts. Maybe not for like the first two. The first two should be quite easy to speed trial, and like maybe the third one as well like third fourth fifth kind of uh charts then you're gonna really want to memorize them actually not world four world four is just really easy but apart from like all the ones that you find hard really memorize it in your head because the faster the chart is the less time you have to think right so say you're doing this one uh level five in 1.5 times speed you're not going to have too much time to think like you really want to memorize it so that you just like memorize it on normal speed and then when you go faster you already know how to do it but just you've got to do it faster i don't know if that made sense but that's how i definitely did it and that's also also goes for like world seven eight all, all the bottom ones as well like because i know you have to speed trial them as well literally just memorize it in your head so when you go faster it gets a lot easier trust me that's coming from experience and now for the um, accuracy side of things for the accuracy the only thing I can suggest is like make sure really focus in on when you're pressing it like you gotta have a kind of a good sense of rhythm for this but you know it's not too hard all you need to do is make sure that you're getting perfect make sure that like you're not messing up uh, but really the accuracy is kind of easy I can't lie if you manage to do that right uh, you should unlock world B or world 7 if you want to call it that I don't really know and then yeah to get the other achievements, all you need to do is just complete this. It's not even that hard. Yeah, just complete this. You don't have to get all the speed trial or anything else. And then you should get that achievement. So next on the list um, is, well, you could say it's the bottom ones. But, you know, after you do the top ones, just make sure you get three lanterns on the bottom ones. So you need to do the accuracy and you need to do the speed trials for the bottom worlds as well to get more achievements. But that's not even that hard. Because as long as you, like, memorize it for the speed trials and you really focus on your accuracy for the accuracy one it should just come with time like and the most important thing is if you're patient with it and you really put time into practicing these you should get it like guaranteed it's it's really not that hard once you really practice a level okay the next batch of achievement is the dlc one and some people won't be able to complete these ones obviously because they don't have the DLC. It's it's like a couple of pounds or dollars. I don't know. It's it's not that much. If you want to get it, it's quite cool, cool as well. You get like these hold notes. But yeah, I'm getting distracted. Uh, what you want to do, I think is, I can't really remember the achievement. But what I think you need to do is just complete it. I don't think you need to get speed trials or anything else like that. As long as you just complete the world, you should unlock the achievements. And then obviously you do have to uh, get the EX ones as well. And to get the EX, I think you have to get a certain amount of medals as well i think that's how it works i can't really remember i haven't played the dlc in a while but yeah i think we have to do is get a certain amount of medals and you unlock the ex worlds so oh yeah all you really need to do is beat the five main worlds up here and then beat the five ex worlds down here and then you should get like 10 more achievements it's really cool for the, for the tips though and then yeah that's really it i wouldn't really i don't really have too many tips for this one uh i can't really remember how the dlc works as well but yeah again practice like practice is a lot memorize them you know have fun with it as well don't let it like get you down if you fell or whatever but yeah it's really it's really not that uh difficult once you once you really learn a level and that's really all i have to say for the uh for the dlc side of things and for the final three achievements what you need to do is first of all you come up here to the extra island and i know there's a lot of levels here but what it wants you to do is you need to beat all of these so you need to beat uh this one all the way up to the, the top one up here and I don't know if I don't think you need to get the uh, accuracy lantern. I think you can have whatever accuracy you want. And then once you've beaten them, that gets you one achievement. You used to beat all of them for one achievement. And then if you come over here, you just speed trial all of them for the, another achievement. But some of these levels are actually good, so it shouldn't be too hard. 
Uh, one thing I can suggest, uh, for this one you can use as many checkpoints as you want, I think. So you don't have to like rush it, just use your checkpoints and it should uh, get you the achievement. But for this one over here, at the speed trials, you can't use achievements. So again, really familiarize yourself with the chart if it's taking you a lot of time. As, you know, that really increases your chances at being able to speed trial it. Uh, but there, yeah, that gets you two of the final achievements. So we need to move on to the last one now. Okay, and for the last achievement, uh, you need to come over here and complete this one. And then you need to complete this one. And I think, I'm not too sure, I think you need to speed trial both of these as well to be able to unlock uh, the last one here. So once you've uh, beat these two up here, speed trial them, which will unlock this, and then you need to beat this one for the final achievement. Uh, yeah, that was really it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed and I hope that it helped you out on how to beat the achievements. Uh, it was just kind of an overall guide on what they were. And I just wanted to like share some tips I had with it. And you know, really the only real way to beat these is to really get it in your head, to really uh, practice these a lot, and just don't like, don't uh, stop, you know? Don't give up or whatever, literally just keep on going. You should be able to beat it, and then you get all the achievements. Really that simple. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you later. Bye.